Lance Bearer. Please tell us the good news. Have you put an end to the epidemic? My hypothesis was correct. Doris Fletcher was the source of the contagion in this part of town. She was probably the first to be infected. And you cleansed her before the hunters, I've been told. Well done, Dr. Reed. You thrust your lance and pierced the very heart of the corruption. I did my best. The important thing is, we won a major battle for the survival of London. For that, we salute you. Thank you, my lord. Now, I have another... Thank you, my lord. One of the utmost importance. Perhaps even more so than the previous. I'm listening. It's time for you to perform a most sacred duty for the club. I want you to recruit a new vampire. Recruit a new vampire? Are you sending me on some sort of diplomatic mission? Not exactly. I want you to make Aloysius Dawson the Ekon he deserves to be. I'm not sure I'm the best candidate for such a task. I can hear the hesitation in your voice, Dr. Reed. I'm not even going to be having to uh, recruit somebody. It's not a moral question, Lord Redgrave. It's the responsibility of giving immortality to a man I barely know. Nonsense. Aloysius has been a member of the Ascalon for years. This is but the fruition of a long-held plan. How would you like me to proceed? Aloysius is waiting for you at the Dawson Estate. Once the deed is done, I'll join you there to celebrate this momentous occasion. Your word is my command. Alright, so we gotta find that Aloysius guy and pretty much bite him and make him immortal. So we gotta reach Temple Church entrance. That means we gotta get out of here. Alright, so... Alright, so the stairs is over here. Are you alright, Jonathan? Lord Redgrave has just ordered me to turn Aloysius Dawson. To make him my progeny. I see. And how do you feel about this? I'd like your advice on the matter. The real question here is, why has his lordship given you this task? Do you think it's some sort of trap? Do you really want to know what I think about this? Is it a proof yes. of loyalty? To make an immortal of a soulless blackguard like Aloysius Dawson will only lead to a disaster for London. The man is already dead inside. Should I refuse? Perhaps politely suggest that Lord Redgrave turn the man into a vampire himself. Don't you dare, my dear. According to what I've recently discovered, his lordship could kill you for even broaching the subject. Really? Why? I've recently found proof that the Earl of Bristol is of lesser lineage and only capable of creating skulls. Please tell me more about your recent investigation. As long as you lower your voice. Goodbye for now, Elizabeth. Goodbye, my dear. Please, be careful. Alright, let's leave this place. It looks like vampires have to obey Mendel's laws when producing progeny. Powers pass from one generation to another. That's why Dawson wants me to sire him. Alright, I had to do a lot of upgrades before I started this episode. Just gonna upgrade my weapon, get my stamina up, get my health up, my blood capacity a little bit up. Just so I can handle these people here. Yeah, so I was level 17 before and I'm at 22, so that's 5 levels up. Oh damn, my weapon's definitely stronger. Let's see if she has anything I can pick up. Yep.
You're dead now. I gotta get this guy. These people are annoying. Just because you gotta keep dodging, man. Don't wanna get hit by those. Especially if you got the flame on it. fighting these people let me check my map make sure I'm going in the right direction okay yeah it'll actually take me through yes I gotta go that way just get to the other side oh come on not even let me hit this dude These upgrades are definitely helping. I know there was somebody up there. Yeah, a guy with a hero. Okay, I don't know if I could teleport up there or what. Let's see what this is. Nothing. Oh, it's actually for investigation. Where the guests are blindfolded before being seated. Intriguing. Oh, there's a way up. He's mine! I'll take it! I just want to see if there's anything handy up here. Trying to make it quick, well, as quick as I can. Let's see, it's a blood trail. What's that? Nice. Oh shit. Wasn't expecting to see freaking vampires up in here. Wait for him to put those hands down. I should oh, that's the last frail to text I needed swamper. to. Yeah, that's for another side mission, so I'll do that afterwards. That was in the way. Oh, okay, it's this way. Oh, no, no, that's where I was before. Okay, yeah. So I was saying I have to go around. As if it takes me around. Which I think it does. If I break through here, maybe.
I don't know how he got me there. Is there another one? Oh, it's a wolf. Oh, this area is too small for us to be fighting. Oh, I missed. Oh, no, no, no. Is that somebody's house? Hoping this takes me, I don't know. Oh, I'm so off. Uh, it's got to be a way around I here. I think this passage could lead me close to Aloysius Dawson's mansion. Uh, I don't know what passage he's talking about, but okay. As long as I know it's over here. This is my... Oh, they can use that move now? Ah, it's probably this passage. Hold up, is this not it? Hold on, this has to be it. Yeah, because I don't think I've ever been in here before. I can't believe I'm doing this. Hold on, it's like two different ways. No, it's just one. Yep, I knew it was going to be somebody down here. Oh, he's, he's almost like Fergal. It's not even attacking. Oh, there we go. Damn. Which, let me watch out for that. Got me with it. I will crush you. Ah! 
I don't know, this guy's honestly weak. I will honestly be I will honestly be surprised if he beat me somehow. It doesn't really block at all. Yeah, this guy was super weak. Thought I seen something on the ground. Alright, this may be the way I'm gonna see what was up top then. Louise's father was determined to find and save her. Oh, I guess they're down here too. Alright, so I guess we'll do a little side mission too while we're at it. Okay. Let's see what these do. Raises that up. That settles it back down. What if I hit it like that? Uh, it sets it down to the bottom. It's locked. Keep moving forward. Well, what's here? Something here? Somebody behind me. Oh, come on, bro. Let me move back. Oh, wow. I was just about to dodge, too, because I didn't want to get hit by that. let us teleport up there. Oh, unless we gotta lower it back down since we got this door unlocked. 
Let me try that. Let's see what happens if I lower it down. doesn't do nothing I cannot enter oh okay Saver. So we'll show you weak, you bitch. Alright, he's pretty strong. Definitely use this on you. Are you all right? How do you know my name? Who are you? My name is Dr. Reed. I managed to track you down thanks to your father. So my father really was looking after me. This man, this vampire told me my father was dead. Is it true? I'm afraid so, miss. I'm so sorry for your loss. But you are free to go, as your abductor is no more. I suppose my jailer also killed my father, didn't he? Thankfully, he did not search your father's corpse where I found his notes describing where he might find you. You should read them. I must find my father's body. He deserves a proper burial. Goodbye, Miss Teasdale. And be careful. Until we meet again. I'll probably end up finding her at the West End. That won't be until I take like another rest. Okay. I think we're heading up here. Oh, nice. Hold on, I'm gonna have to check that weapon out. Damn, 126. We made it. Oh, I guess this mansion's up here. I see some people. That's Dawson right there. I have the hell be getting your mansion. I might have ran past it. Yeah, I might have ran past it. Wonder what this does. 
I don't know, it kind of what it makes me avoid them. Is this Dawson? It's lie. locked, all right. They are never easy to read. Jonathan Reed. Last we meet. The cards warned me you would visit tonight. I beg your pardon, sir. Do I know you? Of course you do. Our mutual friend, Dr. Swansea, can't speak highly enough of you. My name is Usher. Usher Talltree. You are the leader of the Brotherhood, are you not? Primate of the Brotherhood. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, so thing to do. Stole, to be precise. I'm really glad we met tonight. I love it when the cards tell me a truth. The cards told you to expect me? Yes, they tell me everything. They told me that you struggle hard not to take too many lives. Is there anything you could tell me about Aloysius Dawson? Aloysius Dawson? Yes, of course. We met on several occasions. With time, he got deeper and deeper into the occult. He's not the only one. It's been quite the fashion for several decades. The Golden Dawn, for instance, is just one example. True. Aloysius was a member of the Golden Dawn until 1900. Then his thirst for dark knowledge grew. I'm talking forbidden texts, readings which blackened his heart. At least we got a hand on him. Until we meet again. I rarely wander. Yet it amuses me to converse with your kind. Alright, I'm gonna head back racing those guys on the benches. I don't know what those buttons are there for. I don't they they must serve some type of purpose if they do that. you're doing here at this late hour? I'm conducting an investigation about the epidemic in this part of town. And who are you, sir? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed from the Pembroke Hospital. May I ask who you are and why all the questions? I'm Detective Inspector Charles Albright from Scotland Yard, and I don't find your answers convincing. What is a Pembroke doctor doing in the West End at this time of night? for the Ascalon Club. Here is my permit to go freely about the city. The Ascalon Club? You should have said so, sir. I must warn you, these streets are dangerous, and you'd better be careful. Do you know anything in particular about a man called Aloysius Dawson? Who doesn't know the man? I think he intervened personally to put an end to the police strike of last August. What else can you tell me about him? Aloysius Dawson is exactly the kind of powerful and influential man who could commit murder and get away with it, with just one phone call. Goodbye, Detective Inspector Albright. Goodbye, Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm sure we'll talk again soon. Yes, we will. Good evening, sir. I'm Dr. Reed. Can I be of assistance? Dr. Reed? Dr. Reed? Is there yeah, both them two wrong? people no, look alike. Just... Your name sounds familiar. And your face. Have we met before? I think I would remember. So I suppose the answer is no. That's odd. I'm certain I've already heard of you. My name is Pericles Baker. Does that mean anything to you? I'm afraid not, sir. But it's a pleasure to meet you anyway. Hmm. The pleasure is mine, I guess. I only wish I could remember when it was that we met. Well, I don't give a damn about it. What can you tell me about Aloysius Dawson? I've heard this is a man who has searched for his place in the world for a long time. I hope he found it. Goodbye, Mr. Baker. Talk to this last guy. Good evening, sir. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed. Do you need my help? Yes, please. Would you be kind enough to tell me what the time is? That's all you need to know. Well, is it not important to know? As important as where you are? Or who you are? I suppose you're right. And who are you then, sir? I am Agamemnon Baker. Oh, like okay, so mother, they're related. We need to leave this city immediately. Explains it. 
and my brother and I rarely These are twin brothers. Anything. What can you tell me about Aloysius Dawson? You should ask that question to my brother instead. Personally, I've not seen Aloysius for many years. Goodbye for now, Mr. Baker. That's all I need to know. Check on this side, see if there's like another entrance. I don't know if this is his mansion or, or what. Really don't know. Hopefully we can enter his mansion through this way. Cause I haven't been through here yet. Yep. Find Dawson. Here I am at last. But the question remains Am I ready to make a dying man my progeny? Finally, you're here, Dr. Reed. What took you so long? I had to pass several of your barricades and outposts to access your mansion, sir. Death, pestilence surround us, and time is against me. I see you've gathered some of the most expensive, albeit experimental, blood transfusion equipment available. All this could be so useful in a hospital. Yes, yes. Since Lord Redgrave sent me a doctor to perform my conversion, I thought you might find some of these devices useful. Most thoughtful. But tonight I'm not here as a physician. But I feel reassured that a specialist such as yourself would help me to escape the Reaper. Very well. But before I proceed, I have a few questions for you. If you must, but be quick, for I don't have much time left in this life. First of all, I need to be sure that you know exactly what is going to happen to you, sir. I can assure you I'm as informed as any man can be. I have planned for this moment, Dr. Reed. Planned very carefully. Believe me, there is a huge difference between reading about vampires and waking up as one. I learned that myself the hard way. Oh my god, man, stop your whining. I don't <laughs> have time for your pointless jibber jabber. Let's move on then. Please, I'm cold and tired. I feel my life waning with every moment. But first, before you embrace immortality, what would you do with such a gift? That's a rather impertinent question, Dr. Reed. And I will do as I please. Answer me all the same. 
What will your first action be as an immortal? To save London. I will finance the most efficient quarantine ever seen. I will build a wall that will separate the sick boroughs from the healthy ones. I've heard enough. It's time to proceed. At last! All right, do what you have to do. If it hurts, so be it. I've been preparing such a long time for this. Hmm. No alternative, I don't care about sacrificing XP. Are you ready for immortality, Mr. Dawson? Drink now. And say farewell to life as you prepare to be reborn. What do you mean, drink? What about the blood transfusion? I'm the doctor and the vampire here, so I'll give the orders. <laughs> drink, sir. Now. All right. Good. It's an nice so. That's enough. <laughs> That's enough, I said. This freaking guy. It's like I feel better already. I will not die. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh no. You will die, sir. Steal yourself. You're already in death. go back to Lord Redgrave and we'll pretty much wrap up this episode here. Oh, this in right here? I Is bet. it done, Dr. Reed? Is Aloysius Dawson reborn as expected? Yes, my lord. Ascalon has a new recruit as you ordered. Wonderful news. I've waited for this outcome for so long. Tonight you served your country, the king himself, beyond all expectation. Thank you, my lord. No, thank you, Dr. Reed. Now, could you do me one last favor? Of course. What is it? Go outside and talk with that disgusting creature I saw waiting for you in front of this mansion. I have no idea what you're talking about, but I'll have a look. Good. I didn't kill her on the spot. Oh, that's about Lady Ashbury. Of yours. But don't you dare such a creature near me again. Is that the end of this mission? Yep. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this episode here. That's episode 10. And I think we have like six more missions left, so we're coming really close to the end of this game, which I can't wait to wrap it up, because we've been doing it for a good minute, but if you enjoyed this guys be sure to drop a like, comment, subscribe, and also tap that post notification bell. And I will see you guys later. Peace out and take care.